Hey guys, we got a uh, water heater. We've replaced the uh, upper and lower thermostats and uh, we're still tripping. So one of the uh, things we're going to do, we've already ohmed out the uh, elements here. We were getting the 15 ohms. Uh, these are 3,500 watts. If you use your ohm chart based on 3,500 watts, it should be at right around 15 to 16 ohms. So our ohms were showing good. So um, I personally, made the uh, mistake of not going any further and replaced just the thermostats thinking that my elements were fine. So now, uh, this is what I should have done, take my amp draw. So we take our amp draw and we're showing 18.5. And so what we're gonna do next is take 240 uh, volts, which is what's coming in. Make sure you measure it because it could be 245 or 238. Whatever your voltage is, you're gonna do voltage times amps. That's gonna give you your watts. And as you can see, this is a 3,500 uh, watt amp, or watt element. Uh, when I did my calculation, I was coming up with 4,300 watts. So that tells me that there's some sort of an issue with the element. Uh, then we're going to take a temperature of the element as it's running. And so as you can see, we're getting 120 there, but our tank here is very low. So we have a lot of resistance right here in the head of this element. So that tells me that we have an issue with the element. Um, so that's the way to uh, diagnose the elements uh, other than ohms. Uh, as always guys, like, subscribe, and have a wonderful day.